Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to if you haven't been here before. My name is Jay Mahogany and if you're into makeup and random stuff then this channel is for you. Um, and also I'm going to try a different approach today. So I'm just going to talk through my video because like I feel like you guys would get to know me a little bit better if I speak a little bit more and not do the voiceover. So boom on that and then <laughs> what else am I going to do? I don't know. Ooh. Oh, I'm supposed to be saying, <laughs> I'm sorry guys. Um, I know that it has been a minute. I'm so sorry. I just had to get adjusted with the timing and all this extra stuff, but don't worry boo. Cause every week, I know I said that last time, but I was in Michigan getting everything together. So forgive me. Nobody's perfect. I gotta work it. Y'all know y'all know that song by Hannah Montana. I don't know Hannah Montana. I don't know what to say. Anyway, I'll get into the video. All right, so today I don't know how I'm doing my makeup, but I'm just going to do it anyway. Um, let's get started. If I am looking like, then I'm just looking in the mirror. That's I'll put it over a little bit. I'm going to be using Anastasia Beverly Hills, the brow and the color Ebony, okay? Okay, so my first random thought, right? Um, all you women that like The Pea Fairy by Janae, but you don't like WAP, you need to reevaluate your mind because, I mean, of course WAP isn't for everybody, blah, blah, blah. But if you're listening to stuff like that, and you listen to rap in general, even from the male base, baby, what you mad for? Because really what they're saying is basically shit you say. And pretty much all these little songs. And why are you talking about serenading your other with the pea fairy, I'm trying not to say that word, y'all. I don't know what age range is watching. <laughs> um, literally, you should not say anything if you listen to any music that's vulgar in general. Sexuality isn't a bad thing, like, and all these men that's talking about, oh, you know, like she's supposed to be a wife and a this and that whatever bruh like i'm so tired of that stigma that says that women should be a certain way i'm i'm not you know like that in any shape or form i don't be like you know carrying myself in that way but like if a hoe chooses to speak about their sexuality or have you know risque pictures on social media or whatever i'm not gonna say a hoe i'm gonna say a woman because that doesn't make you a hoe then that's their business why are people so worried like but if a dude was like coming out with a song talking about he wants some what then what <laughs> okay y'all be like hey, yeah we want that yeah that's all I'm gonna say on that. <laughs> all right, and then to make my eyebrows more shapely, I'm gonna be using LA Pro Girl in the color Fawn. And then also like another topic, like for instance, how people used to say like, oh, well, you know, Kim Kardashian, she's always half naked and she had a sex tape or Amber Rose or whatever, like, that's their fucking business. Like, if you don't want to live your life like that, don't live your life like that. It's that simple. Even with homosexuality, like, um, people be, like, trying to comfort people for liking what they like. When in reality, like, how does it bother you? I don't understand that either. Because you're not really seeing what they're doing 
yeah i know there is more flamboyant um people out there i'm looking for a brush so yeah i know that it's more flamboyant people out there but it's still none of your business because that's their sense of freedom in a way you know like maybe they were hiding you know their sexuality for a long time and now they're more comfortable with their selves or you know whatever it may be like grow the fuck up grow up that's all i'm gonna say period i don't know what else to say what y'all doing i mean obviously i'm doing my makeup <laughs> Abby. Uh, I slick need my eyebrows back, like, or something, cause you can slick see my eyebrow. Can y'all see it? <laughs> can y'all see it? Cause, baby, I can, especially in this little zoom in mirror. Okay, do y'all remember the first time y'all got like one of these mirrors, and you're like, oh, my makeup gonna be so cute. My makeup finna be so cute and shit. But really, it just makes you like, I guess, concentrate more. Because you be like, what the fuck? Like, I didn't even notice what's on. For my primer, I'm going to be using the Too Faced Hangover. It's just big as hell because, you know, I'm extra. It's the same one, babe. Same one. How do people be talking and doing their makeup? This is hard. Also, I'm gonna put y'all on real quick. Cause you can't get this everywhere. You have to buy it like at a spa or you can get it online, I think. But anyway, this is the Eminence Hydration Spray. So my trick with this basically is when you put like a hydration mist or a hydration primer or something and you do the rest of your makeup matte, it will not feel dry. Like, you know how some, um, I can't even think. You know how some, like, makeup, like, you put matte primer, matte this, matte that, and then you be like, ooh, my face feels so tight and dry. Duh. For my foundation, this has really been my favorite lately, the Juvia's Place. Um, I'm going to be using the color 240. Y'all, forgive me, because... I cannot pronounce some of these countries at least. <laughs> I mean, I can, but I don't want to say it wrong and then y'all come for me in the comments. That's all I'm saying. This has been my favorite because like with um my skin being more tan because of the hot summer, works a little bit better for me. And it's like perfect, honestly, the thickness. I don't know about y'all, but um, baby, I do not like no sheer natural makeup. Okay, call me Patrick Star. For real, I really don't like sheer makeup like that. I don't like sheer foundation. Like, make me look porcelain, honey. Make me look porcelain. Like, y'all see how that lays, bruh? So nice. So nice. I don't even know, like, lately I've been feeling very happy like i was going through oh this hair is wrong where does it come from my lashes and i don't have makeup wipes y'all that's messed up but anyway um i've been feeling like very very happy and i feel like that's a huge accomplishment for me because i was going through like a really depressed time in my life and if you've ever like feel down just know that it's only temporary I know it's easier said than done like you feel like you're in a dark space um, but I don't know how to explain I guess what you feel today you may not feel tomorrow uh, that pretty much goes for anything you know and I just want you guys like if you are going through something to really 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 take the time to 
heal yourself. Like, it's okay to go to therapy. It's okay to, you know, take time to yourself. Like, it's okay. Like, motherfucker. The reason why I just cuss like that is because I usually do my eyes first. And I always sat now. I guess I could do it now. What y'all think? I guess I'm gonna do it. Okay, so I think I feel like being um black today, like black eyeshadow. Not literally, like I feel like being black today. I like being black every day. I'm gonna be using the P. Louise eyeshadow primer in the color black. Just so you know, if you're doing black eyeshadow, bomb.com to use black eyeshadow primer because you know how some black eyeshadows like you have to like pile it on i'm gonna do that i might have to do this off camera because um i don't think i can talk and do this hey guys i got my primer on i'm gonna be using the black smoked out color inside of this what is this called fierce by nature morphe okay so yeah like i was saying um if you're feeling any type of way, like emotionally, mentally, I mean, please hold on. Like I said, I was in a very, very dark space. So, um, that's like my testimony for that. Whew, it is hard to talk as you wake up. Who came up with this? See, that's why I just do my little voice up. But y'all, I really do want y'all to know like my personality a little bit more. So I'm like, okay, well, new approach. <laughs> okay, this is not my finished eye, but I guess I'm gonna start um, like my concealer and stuff so the rest of it doesn't fall down on my foundation. I'm gonna use the same concealer that I um, shade my brows with under my eyes. Dude. I'm just so ready for like, corona to be over because my birthday is coming up and like I literally have nothing to do I mean yeah you can go eat but that's all we've been doing literally like bitches is tardy I know you got cop oh my god I never really even say cop look at that New word, dictionary. For those who don't know what cap means, it means lying. Just putting you in on the, the urban lingo. This is my favorite concealer to this day. Like, yeah, I love all that other stuff, don't get me wrong, but this is my absolute faves, babies. This is so weird not doing your eyes first. I don't even know like what to do. That's why I'm like breaking it up in increments, I guess. Oh, and by the way, this isn't a beauty blender. It's a, um, <laughs> what's this? The Beauty Bakery Egg. And boo, it's so soft. It expands when you wet it. It is everything. Oh, do you guys see my septum? I know I look a mess right now because I have makeup all over myself. But I got my septum pierced a few months ago. I lied. It's only been like two months. I don't know. I honestly don't remember when I got it. <sighs> but it's really not that bad. All right. Now I'm going to be using the Juvia's Place in 205 just to add more definition to my face. And y'all, like I said, this is not my finished eye book. Look, so don't be clicking out because you think this is. Oh, y'all like my hair, honey. Okay, so this isn't like my forever thing, I guess. Um, The reason why I had got hair or whatever was because I'm trying to grow my hair for a certain like cut. But, you know, I'm not gonna be looking homeless in between time. So I was like, let me just make a leg or whatever. At first it was weird to me, but now, cause I hadn't had hair for like a long time. But now it's like a, 
a normal thing. Oh my God, my headband is being rubbed. It's okay, I'd rather that than my lace. To make my eyes a little bit brighter underneath, I'm going to be using the Too Faced Born This Way Concealer, the color Warm Sand. Just a little bit low, like, low. You don't want it to look casket friendly. I guess I'm gonna put a little bit on my nose too. Clear <laughs> <Yeah>, my chin. <laughs> Makeup is making my headband look so dirty. Now I'm gonna be using the Too Faced setting powder and translucent. I'm gonna go ahead and set under my eyes so I can finish my eye look. I have been um trying Fenty Skin for a week now. I didn't wanna I wanted to make a video, but I didn't want to make the video without um like my true opinion. No thanks. I'll have a video for that coming soon. Coming real soon. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna be snatched, okay? So I'm gonna be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Nirvana um, eyeliner. Okay guys, so I went ahead and I did my um, liner off camera. Cause it was hard. I'm trying to talk through that. You know, this is my first time using it. I thought it was gonna be like a matte, but it's more like glossy i hate how my headband looks dirty now it makes me want to change it but anyway i'm going to take that same black color from earlier and i'm going to go under my eye just like that like so what's her name the lady mm -hmm. that's your business she seems like she's like a really great like mom person like a old soul like now we're gonna use the Fenty Beauty, uh, what's this, bronzer? <laughs> Sorry about the glare. Um, what's this color, Coco Naughty. I was trying to do my makeup yesterday and it was not it. So, well, I just didn't like it um, personally. You know, you know what I'm talking about. When your makeup just isn't what you thought it exactly was gonna be. Now I'm gonna be doing my lips. I'm gonna line them first with the NYX Espresso, okay? Now I'm gonna be using the NYX Lip Gloss in the color Free Bird. Mm. More nude. Be our bag. I want the colors to be a little bit more pigmented, so I'm gonna use, um, what's this? Morphe in the color cream. Yeah. Cause I'm extra, I'm gonna put this on top, MAC. Lip gloss. Should I do blush? Okay, now I'm going to be using Juvia's Place blush in the color Bella. I guess it's a Bella on the front, so I'm guessing it's that. <gasps> so cute. We almost finished. And then I'm gonna use this for my mascara, the Too Faced Better Than Sex. I still can't get over this headband. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I'm gonna take it off, y'all. Hold on. Yo, this lip combo. I'm really kind of feeling this, no lie. Okay, I gotta put my lashes on because you don't know until your lashes. Okay, so I'm gonna be using um, Desi's Glam Box. This is like, you know, a small company, so go support. I'm gonna use the Style and Unicorn, okay? Y'all know that song? I can feel it coming in here tonight. Hold on. Boom, 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 boom. I've been waiting for you. The whole video, my toilet did not make one noise, and now it want to be ghetto as soon as I start singing. I'm just not sure I'm singing. I have a song right now. Put it in the um the comments. I don't know what my favorite song is right now, honestly. I really been feeling um okay, so like a rap song, I guess that I'm feeling right now. By Mel is The Woo with Roddy Rich and 50 Cent, period. Okay, rest in peace, Pop Smoke. 
Um, I love Roddy so much. If you're really close to me, you know that I love Roddy. What's the song? Did I say Pac Light by Queen Nigel? That's an R&B song that I'm really feeling. I love anything Summer Walker, period, because that's what's up. Hold up. Period. Speaking of, I'm going to take this motherfucker hat off because this is not hot. Hold up. I'll be right back. Okay, y'all. I'm trying to get her together, okay? Um. <laughs> Does she need glue? Well, I'm trying to fix my wig. I almost forgot about my lashes. Okay, y'all. I... I kind of fixed my wig, not really. Um, Cause she needs some tender loving care. This is a closure, by the way. <sighs> the frontals be too much sometimes. I'm not even gonna lie, like, and it's too fucking hot for that. And also I put my lashes on. Like I said, this is the Cali Lot. Oh, I lie, it's Unicorn and from um <laughs> Desi's Glam Box. So check her out, all right? I'm gonna just leave my wig so I can I'll fix it all later when I get dressed. Um but if you're wondering about this hair, it is um just it's true glitter hair. And the water um Indian water wave. And if you're looking, like, if you think, like, something is too expensive or something, like, um, on the 1st and the 15th, they have 30% off. Well, I don't necessarily, like, glue my wig down. I just, um, put a little bit. My boyfriend's Jamaican. Mm. I just go like that in the corner. The way that the bands are in it, I don't need to, um glue it down it stays literally like even if somebody pulled my hair they would have to pull it like hella hard lastly i'm going to be using the morphe setting spray why do you guys take a shower right now all right y'all i'm gonna go put on my outfit and i'll be right back Okay, guys, this is it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I'll probably do more videos like this because, like, I kind of like talking to y'all or whatever. Um, oh, I still need to fix my closure. It's okay. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed once again. Like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I will see you guys next time.